Okay, so I'm just going to explain a little bit on how to do the next part here. Uh, so you've uh, gone through the e-learning quickly, just looking at things that you're not sure about that needs more explaining. And then I already went through the next steps in the course overview. So this is really the first unit. Okay, so you want to watch this video here, which um, will explain to you what this um, content is all about. Uh, basically what you're doing is uh, a bit of a diagnostic about your skills according to the strands of our English curriculum. So you already wrote something in the next steps under your two cents worth sharing our ideas. So you already did that. And so we still need to look at the oral strand, reading comprehension, and your media analysis. So I'm not going to detail this because if you watch that other video it'll detail it. Um, but the first thing you're going to be doing is joining a discussion. So if you click join the discussion it should send you to that discussion. What are my skills? Will our children be ready? So you're going to answer a few questions um, based on that video you just watched. But make sure you write in paragraph format. It's always good to keep that in mind. When you're going through the content, see this little button right here? You can go full screen so that you can see it better. And sometimes there's these little widgets here. Um, it'll tell you that it's interactive. So this one has some tips for discussion. You click the begin and then every time I click here a new thing will come on, sort of like a little PowerPoint. And then next, it might they, those bubbles might come on on their own even if you don't click. And yes, they do come anyway even if you don't click. And then you just you can just go through there and, and look at what the the um, parameters are for discussing online. And then here it's going to assess your reading skills, your ability to find information and reference points in. Uh, in re in when you read something, so it's basically uh, reading diagnostic. And then you're going to submit your work just like you did your personal plan. You click this and it goes to the um, Dropbox, but I'm not in the student view, so it doesn't look like that. Your Dropbox looks different. And then your skills in oral communication. So this one, you're going to watch this and then do a response in an oral, using an oral, um, like you can, you can talk into your phone. So this is an oral submission. So you're going to make an a audio file and submit it to this Dropbox. They suggest you go to Vidyard, Go Video, but it's, uh, it's it's a Chrome extension and it's really easy to use if you don't want to use your phone. Most computers uh, have a thing where you can just talk into it or record your voice. So that's that's what you have to submit an audio file there. And then they're asking you to assess this picture and again submit your work to the Dropbox. and more strategies for effective discussions here and that just talks about blogging and how important it is to keep writing and practicing and stuff like that we have a blog uh, our, our grade 9 blog it's called prodigious, prodigious nines uh, we're not posting to it right now uh, but the next uh, in the next unit we'll post to that so you, the, it is asking you for your first portfolio reflection. There'll be a number of portfolio reflections throughout the course. Um, so you can decide how, how many words you're going to use. I would say maybe 100 words, not, not, nothing too long. Um, and then just, um, it just asking you what, some, what are some specific skills that you'd like to work on. 
So is it uh, writing? Is it oral presentation? Is it reading comprehension? Or is it media analysis, basically? And this tells you where this portfolio is. It's on the top bar of the course. And there's a video uh, on how to find it. And then at the end of this unit, as at the end of every unit, there's a little checklist that you can check mark. Yep, I did that, did that, did that. Okay, so let me, uh, so there, there it is right there. There's your portfolio. If I click it, it'll go to my portfolio. Okay. Oh, there's a, there's a link right here to our Prodigious, Prodigious Nines WordPress blog, and there's some blogging tips, but what we're not asking you to make your own blog and we're not asking you to post to this yet. Okay, Oak, so just uh, work away on that and it should give you plenty to do. So just email me if you have any concerns or if I need to explain something more fully.